what's up guys um quick little video here um as you guys may know already or you guys may have him but the car the e9 the bmw e90 passed inspections smog check brake inspection lamp inspection everything's good to go so um tomorrow i'll be i'll be going to dmb and get my plates so um now that the car passed inspections now i could start moving around you know the headlights and stuff things that i didn't like or or um in this case i'm just gonna do the halo lights brighter so um that's what this video is about i have my carly app you guys you can see on the screen i have the carly adapter right there i don't know if you guys can see it yeah right there it's on so that's what we're trying to do and this is just gonna take a, a couple minutes guys something quick you could do so we're gonna go to the coating uh, do not show this again continue to coating you gonna check comp compatibility with the e90 and there's a lot of things you could do um so um like i mentioned in my in my other videos um one of you guys was were mentioning that i can't register the battery i haven't tried it honestly um check compatibility carly is running so um but you know i'll take his word so maybe what he said is for the 750 that you can't um and i can't really i believe him i believe him um but i can't there's no way for me to try because you know the 750 is being gone already for a while so i only have the e90 uh, and i don't have a new battery so there's no need for me to register a new battery um so i wouldn't know so there we go do not show this again we're gonna go down to frm light and mirrors so that's what we're gonna we're gonna hit and stable now we're gonna go to read from car so he's backing up just in case you want to bring it back to how it was and that's what it's doing And that's what happened when I was moving, messing around with the Carly app before the the, the um, light inspection. I hit something and I turned off the the quarter um, lights over there on the back, the front end back. I mean, and it didn't pass inspection. So that's why I went back to the Carly app. You know, backed it up to when I first um, to how it was before I start messing around with it, and you know, it, all the lights went on. So, so that was pretty cool. Um, so let me see. Front fog lights with high beams, interior lighting. And your eyes bright. Brightness. So that's where we're gonna go. Right now we are at current value. Um, let me hit very high guys. I'm just gonna hit the cord. Cord the car, okay. Understood. So that's pretty much it, guys. That's pretty much it. Um, that's all you need to do to cord the car to make your um, halo lights brighter. So I'm gonna turn off this screen recording thing and I'm gonna go back to the regular camera. So see you guys in a bit. I coded the car now. But this freaking thing is hot. So there they are. Supposedly they're brighter, not sure. Okay guys, so I made the halo lights brighter, but for now I want to get the daytime running lights off. As you can see in the photo right here, those lights, I hate them. So I'm going to turn those off using the Carly app also. So um, with that said, let's get to it. Okay guys, so we're back to the Carly app and as you can see right here, 
I have the where it says daytime daytime running lights right right exactly where this thing is at you can see like see daytime running lights customization that's what you're gonna hit and then right here we had it at dimmed at, at dimmed high beams so that's where we had it so we're gonna turn it off and we're gonna hit call the car understood okay and um I don't know if you could tell but the light went off over there behind those so let's go check that out there it is guys there it is both sides so that's what I wanted that's exactly what I wanted It just makes it look a lot better guys now what I'm gonna do later on is buy those LEDs um, you know the white LEDs and and install them because I really don't like that yellow color but um that's one of the things you can do also with the Carly app which is pretty cool really really cool now um that's it let me know what you guys think I'll leave the link for this app for the Carly app and the OBD adapter in my video description and also um if you guys want to buy one or i mean if you own a bmw this is really practical like i said um let me let me go back because um maybe on the e90 if you guys own an e90 let me see if i can register the battery continue to battery registration caution let me see please read carefully before yes, performing understand the low pressure releasing the batteries perform on the yard responsibility understood okay let me see okay guys so if you have an e90 maybe maybe with the 750 um you weren't register the battery let me see so yeah i mean i don't want to register my battery my battery is the same one so there's no need for me to register the battery so um read battery data i'm not gonna register the battery guys i just want to check Okay so, okay, so there it is. I could register the battery right here, right at the bottom. I could hit this button and it'll register the battery. Um, I don't want to register the battery, like I said, the battery is the same one. There's, I haven't changed the battery, so though there's no need for me to register the battery. So, um, yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think so far. Um, I'll probably stop the video right here, but um, if I continue, you'll see right now. If not, see you guys in the next one. Okay guys, thank you for watching. That's pretty much it for the video. Um, if you own a BMW, Mercedes, um, Mini Cooper, Volkswagen, if you guys need one, I'll leave the link to it in the description so you guys can check it out. And um, so mainly, you know, it's very helpful, especially if you own like a, like I said, like a Mercedes, a BMW, um, a Mini Cooper that, you know, every time you need to do a diagnostics to it, it's pretty expensive. That's something that's pretty handy to um, to have with you guys and um, it'll save a lot of headaches so that's pretty much it like I said the link in the description don't forget to subscribe if you haven't like the video leave a comment follow me on Instagram and um, that's pretty much it I'll probably upload another video before I go to Mexico like I told you I'm getting ready to go to Mexico um, most likely by when this video goes out I'll be in Mexico already so I'll still have another video going out that's for the when I try to install the Roku stick from my house into the Mazda so I could watch it on the headrest monitor so yeah guys let me know what you guys think so far like I said follow me on Instagram see you guys in the next one